Hey, what's up everybody? Aloha. Um, welcome to the uh, beginner slack key guitar lesson number two. Number one, I posted quite a few years ago. Uh, well, and I figure uh, it's time to do a follow-up. So what I did was I took a moment and I taught uh, on YouTube the first lesson that I give everyone who wants to learn slack key, which is just about positions and alternating bass and finger assignments. This lesson is about the Hawaiian slack key vamp. Uh, here's where we're going with it, here's what it should sound like. So what I'm going to do for this lesson is I'm going to break it down for you, uh, try and show you the different elements, and then put it all back together, play it slow, offer you some tab, and hopefully by the end of it, you'll be able to play it. Okay, so first thing is, just like before, there's an alternating bass line. And the bass is going to keep doing this. Five, four, that's fifth string, fourth string, fifth string, fourth string, fifth string, fourth string. That's going to keep playing throughout your vamp. The melody is going to sound something like this. Three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. One. Now, as you play this melody, you're concentrating on your fingers, your pointer, middle, and ring fingers. You want to make sure that the finger assignment is good. Your pointer finger plays the third string, your middle finger plays the second string, your ring finger plays the third string. Um, watch out for this hammer out. And then, that's a slide. Uh, let me play it for you again. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. All right. Now that's the melody. Um, the key is to get the melody and the bass notes to play at the same time. And so first I'm gonna start a really slow bass line um, and then I'm gonna double time it later. So the vamp with the really slow bass line sounds like this. tap for this below. Now let me just play it one more time slow. So that's the slacky vamp, the Hawaiian turnaround with a really slow bass line. But we're really going for something that uh, where the bass line plays twice as often, but that's a nice way to get you there uh, easily, a little easier to play, and it kind of eases you into playing it. Here's with a bass line that plays twice as often. I'm gonna play that a little bit slower. to notice when certain notes are played together. So as you read the tablature, you really want to take notice of the fact where things line up vertically, they need to happen at the same time. So for example, right there, that's two notes that happen at the same time. Notice that two notes line up vertically, it just means they happen at the same time, so you want to make sure that you pinch on them. Again, slowly. And here's at um, a speed that you're normally going to go at. One, two, three, four. So 
that's a beginner slack key guitar lesson number two. Um, my thanks go out to Kill the Beamer. Uh, I bought his book many years ago and uh, I, that's the way I think about things a lot and he uh, basically taking a, an early lesson from him in the book that talks about the Hawaiian turnaround. So thanks, Kyola. Um, if you like what you see and this is useful to you, feel free to head on over to my website, which is curtiscamilla.com. Feel free to subscribe below and uh, at curtiscamilla.com, feel free to sign up for the newsletter, The Practicing Musician. Uh, until next time, take care. Aloha.